Hello, today we're going to turn this Bootstrap 4 pre-built page on Dreamweaver into this page. As you can see, the navbar being changed to light background and also have a login menu on the right side. And on the card section, we have a four cards in one row on desktop view. If you go to a tablet, you'll be two in a row and phone will be one by itself. Okay, let's do it. Okay, now we are on the drone river now. First thing we should set up our site. So on the desktop you'll see I have demo folder here. Inside the demo is a couple images here. Back to my drone river. Manage site. Add a new site called demo. Point to desktop demo and select save. Done. And create new HTML bootstrap here and create new CSS and check the include pre-built layout created this pre-built page. Bootstrap 3 and 4, the big difference is, is their CSS update. If you delete dark and change the light, or you can just select delete this background dark. This is how you change a uh, net bar. If you want net bar a different color, it's quite easy. Just go add that BG and there's a couple of preset uh, background color here. So you can change the like for instance info, you see kind of sea phone color. So we're going to delete this. Now bring a DOM panel out. This is basically the structure of this page. We are uh, reviving this net bar here. So we just expand this. So first thing we don't need to do search. So select and delete form. UL, this is the structure of your menu. Usually menu is a group. So they use the list. So we don't need this too, so we're just going to delete the last one, disabled, and this drop down. Right click, select duplicate to add one more list. Now we should save this, save as index page, save. Alright, so now we're going to, to duplicate this UL all together because we have a locked in on the right side. So I want you to duplicate and we're going to change to margin left auto so you are all to the back okay we don't need the first one active we don't need that delete and then the second one we're going to delete it double click change the link to locked in okay so we finish our net bar re revision so we can collapse this and then you see the second one is jumbotron and you will see this entire thing is Jumbotron. If you want to use a Jumbotron, that's fine. But I just want to insert a simple image. Use this plus sign here and insert before and a dip text already right there. So I want to insert an uh, image. On the window menu, find your insert panel. Usually I dock the insert panel here. It's be easier for me to see. On the booster component, so you find the image icon, select default, and I'm going to do next. So it will be inside this content. I can double click, delete this word, let go, click somewhere, and then you will see this is a hamburger menu bar here. I select the one that I want, go to image, select kitchen here, okay, and make sure make it responsive. Okay, and it's in this point you should right click on this gray area, it's a shortcut save all and do preview beautiful okay let's go back and then you see we don't need jumbotron right so select entire jumbotron dip area and just delete on the down panel now we're going to work on our car and to expand here and you will see there's a couple rows here it was first thing we want to do is expand this row so there's a three dips here we're going to delete the last two and here we can just select an image here and I guess it make it responsive I guess <laughs> and so this button I don't want to do a button primary so I can delete it and add another uh, class it will start with stop uh, BDTM so I'm gonna select outline uh, primary I guess and then also I want to add another BTM block so just add BTM block. Okay, I'm happy with this layout. I can just duplicate and duplicate four times. 
on the desktop view is way too big for that so I'm just gonna make it smaller for each one so make sure they can stay together in one row yeah okay that's very good and then you can put your cursor on the purple media query bar this will be the tablet view I'm gonna do it two by two here so this one have to be bigger just try an arrow here so okay and then you s click on uh, it's not so good here so you have to change a little bit here okay pretty good pretty good pretty good and then desktop very good and then you should save all and do preview so this is pretty much that we're looking for okay this is the desktop view then tablet then the phone view that's it see you next time